the top stories from ABC News. A Supreme Court has been told a man sentenced to almost 18 years for lighting a Black Saturday bushfire has reduced moral culpability. 42-year-old Brendan Sokoluk was found guilty of deliberately starting the Churchill blaze in 2009. The fire killed 10 people and destroyed more than 150 homes. The court heard Sokoluk suffers from mental impairment. KFC has been ordered to pay $8 million to the family of a girl who was left with brain damage after contracting salmonella poisoning. Monica Saman's family say she became seriously ill when she ate a chicken twister at a Sydney KFC seven years ago. She acquired spastic quadriplegia with brain damage after being in a coma. The husband of a missing Brisbane woman is thanking the public for support as police continue to investigate her disappearance. It's now been more than a week since Alison Baden Clay disappeared from her home. Police were at Brookfield again today, setting up a mannequin in the hope of triggering new leads. And strong winds in northern Spain aren't enough to cancel flights in the region. These planes have been caught on camera landing at the Bilbao airport in winds of up to 65 kilometres an hour. Gusts of above 130 kilometres an hour have been recorded in the region. And those are the latest headlines from ABC News.